Warning, the places that we explore are extremely dangerous. We do not in any way condone trespassing, forcing entry, vandalism or theft. We do this at our own risk to document these places in their current state of decay before they are gone forever. Anyone choosing to visit these locations, do so at their own risk. Stay safe. <laughs> happening guys Ash here from Forgotten Spaces so we've just turned up at a location uh, near Horsham um, it's an old abandoned house it looks like it's got quite a lot of damage on it we're gonna pop inside and have a look and see what we can find if you haven't tuned into this channel before please hit the subscribe button it is like right there just give it a little press it's not gonna hurt uh, tickle that bell for notifications so I can shove some more videos straight at your face <laughs> Wayne just nearly knocked himself out on the gate <laughs> okay guys, so I'm going to turn the camera off while I jump over the fence, but this is where we're going. First things first, this house looks pretty decent, pretty cool. We've got a little shed thing over here, we're going to check it out first before we try and get into the main building. But this is where we are. I want to give a shout out to Carl for giving me this location, thanks very much. Always appreciate it mate. So this is where we are. Uh, this is like an old garage or, yeah, I would say garage. This garage has got a little fireplace and chimney, which is quite cool. We've got central heating in there. Bowl on the floor. This wood doesn't look like it's all that old, so kind of looks like it's uh, a wood shopping or wood storage area. Yeah, so like a log storing room. And then that's just the back there and that chimney. Scrap metal there. Put that in the iron pile. There's like rubble as well, like there used to be another building here. That's a rubble. So, we have got an entry point. It's good news. So that's the back of the house that we're at today. That's pretty cool. We are gonna be going inside, guys, in just a second. I'm gonna be quiet. Be going in. That's the outside of the house done. Massive garden. Okay, so that's the window we came through. It was already smashed. We don't condone any breaking in. Breaking and entering is not our thing. What we do, we get into buildings that are abandoned through somebody else's break in, I suppose. Lovely wallpaper, I would have probably had this. In fact, I'm sure my mum had this carpet in her house. Cool carpet. Kitchen. Wow. Sort of ripped the radiator off the wall. No point in that. Yeah, there really is no point in ripping the radiator off the walls, guys. Little cupboards here. Oh, hello. Yeah, smashing windows. Really, come on guys. It's not uh, urbexes who do this sort of thing. It's vandals, idiots, and dickheads. True urbexes would never smash the windows to get in. For some reason they've smashed all light switches and sockets. As yeah, well. smashed all the light switches, sockets. Take the door off the hinges, yeah. open the door, open the door. Yeah. 
Fireplace. Smashed the fireplace up. So this I would imagine is the living room. Probably uh, spent many a, a year in here in the family home. There's, we're missing something. No, we, are. The, we are. What? Through that door? Through here. Oh, it's locked. No way. I think we can get in around the other side anyway. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be a tricky one, but okay. yeah. So that's the front door. And again, the whole place has been smashed to pieces. Radiator on the floor. really warm in this house yeah. that's like a old fireplace it's pretty cool actually this is this is in a bedroom uh, I'll take that, but yeah old fireplace in the bedroom from back in the day when you would have a fire in your bedroom oh that's great Stupid, childish vandals. Yeah, another fireplace in here. Again, back in the days when you used to have fireplaces in your house. Bathroom, beautiful. Lovely. Again, smash windows. Ah, oh, dead little butterfly in there. Yeah, this place has been completely trashed. Oh, Wayne's going up in the loft. Oh, we got so we got bathroom here, and then connecting bathroom here. There's nothing up in the loft. No, at all. Just a water tank. And the loft. Go. Cool. Things you normally find in a loft. Loft things. Yeah, loft things. Another little cupboard. Uh, one last room over here. Door's not open. Hey. Hello. Hello. Same scenario in here. Yeah. Window smash. Fireplace boarded up there and ripped that part. Yeah. Cool. This, like, apart from the fact that they've smashed the windows out, <coughs> it's kind of been left alone in this room. Still got switches and stuff on the wall. It's almost as if they just forgot about this room. Well, it's a closed door at the moment. I've had the brains to fix open it. Open it, yeah. Okay, so that's 90% of the house done. I did see earlier there is like a next door part to this, so. Uh, it's quite easy to get out the front window, mate. Yeah, probably will. We're going to. Yeah, we're going to shoot outside quickly, make our way round to the other side of the house. Hopefully, we'll be able to get into that little conservatory. Okay, so that was the front window we just got out of. Now we've come into this area here. I'm gonna be quiet because there's neighbours next door. This is a cool little room. Well, I imagine this would have been the sex dungeon. Yeah. Door to that, door to that. Oh, that one, that one, literally, you can see that it just takes you outside. Definitely the sex dungeon. Definitely the sex dungeon. No, lovely little conservatory here. I could imagine just sitting out here on a summer's eve with a fresh cold beer. This is like bathroom number 56 of this house. Bathrooms for days. One, little, one more little room out here. Ah, this is cool. What's this? Ah, definitely shut. Uh, oh, cool. That's cool. So, this would have been like the washroom. Ah, oh, there's the boiler. 
That would have provided the heating or hot water for the house. Heating, I think. Yeah. Yeah, so this would have been like the utility room, I suppose. Nice. So, quite a short video for this one. Um, for those of you who have only just joined the channel, <laughs> hit the subscribe button. <laughs> it is there. Just hit that button, tickle that notifications bell so that I can chuck some more videos straight into your face. Uh, stay tuned for the next episode. Thanks very much for joining us. Peace. Peace. Mm-hmm. <laughs>